go here with the first team to pass CWL, the Invitational Women's 800. And so underway here, and that is Tegan Shine Becker out to the early leadership on the rail. She's followed by Isabel Marsh of Adelphi, and then on the hard cut from the outside, that is Denise Thornton Filia of Goucher wearing hip eight initially, but she has drifted back into the field. And right now, Shine Becker gone away from the field through 200 meters. Again, a positive split race, the 800. So we will do a split check here at 400 as Tegan Shine Becker looks strong on the track here. Cadence is great as she comes to 400 meters rolling there. 60 seconds, and we will call it officially 60.32. So we are on target for something that could be a sub 203 performance here. That would be a great clocking to start the day at Matthewson Memorial Stadium. Down the back stretch here, away from the field, Tegan Shine Becker of Ryder, and the battle brewing there for second place, as that is, I think, Nicholson of Toledo and Seitzinger of Duquesne. But right now at 600 meters, it is all Tegan Shine Becker. Gone away from the field, it is a duel between her and the clock as we watch the opening section here of the women's 800, bringing her up the stretch out of the exchange zone and the turn, 150 on the clock. We are rolling here. Look at the distance on the track and the separation, and that's because we are seeing a superlative performance right about 2.04, 2.04.43, and folks, if that holds, it does, 2.04.44, that is a new facility record here, the former record held by Emily Mackey of Binghamton.